the investor advocate at the SEC is um, my job is basically to provide a voice for investors in the policy making process to make sure that the interests of investors are being appropriately considered as decisions are being made that will have an impact on investors. And while I'm housed at the SEC and I'm an SEC employee, uh, that means I ob I'm obviously looking at rulemakings that flow through the commission, but I'm also supposed to look at rulemakings as they go through the self-regulatory organizations like FINRA and the M MSRB and the stock exchanges. And um, I can make recommendations to Congress as well on legislation that might be beneficial for investors. I guess the most pleasant surprise I've had is just how the, the role has been embraced by people at the SEC. Um, you know, I think there, there may have been some um, concern <laughs> because uh, everybody that comes to work at the SEC considers themselves to be an advocate for investors. That's why they come to the place and come to work for the SEC in the first place. And so I think there was some uh, wariness, I guess, about the role and whether I was going to be, um, uh, I guess, critical. <laughs> of the SEC and all of its decisions that they make. And I, I, I think that um, I've really gotten off to a good start with the staff and with the leadership of the SEC and showing them how my office um, can, can add value to the rulemaking process. A lot of what I do is, is work behind the scenes informally to, to try to influence policy. Um, one thing that I was vocal about um, behind the scenes but not necessarily publicly was the, the proxy um, process, the whole issue around the Whole Foods discussion um, and their attempt to basically keep a, a uh, shareholder proposal off of their proxy. And that, that raised a number of issues about how the SEC had um, analyzed um, that particular issue in the past and I thought that the SEC need to, needed to really rethink its evaluation of shareholder proposals and, and whether the issuer should be able to keep them off of a proxy. And that's ultimately the, what, the, what the chair and what the SEC have done is have sort of gone a different direction.